and gentlemen, members and friends, November bumper outturn is upon us. It's a massive outturn this November with 30 different casks, bundles, events, tasting kits, everything, and of course our advent calendar. It's a very exciting month to lead into Christmas, so we always love doing a massive outturn for November. And I want to just take a moment now, just do a quick video to talk about our, we've got two more for the months in November. And we try to make one a normal malt of the month, which is an accessible fun whiskey that everyone can jump into and a good allocation to go around of a single cask. And then the other malt of the month is a premium malt of the month. Something a bit more special you might want to throw in your um, stocking this Christmas. Uh, this, In this case, it's 4.306 tarred and feathered in our lightly peated profile a 20 year old whiskey from Distillery 4 in Orkney. For those who have been members for a year or more, might remember last November's outturn where Premium Malt of the Month was also a four. It was so popular, we tried to work out so it could happen again this year and it did. So that's very exciting. So it's a 20 year old uh, ex bourbon cask, 55.2% uh, lightly peated. It's called Tarred and Feathered. It says in the front, a stunningly beautiful dram, precision, purity, and gentle Orcadian peat. Single malt originally from bourbon hogsheads married into this cask. So this is an experiment from the spirits team where it was spirit from ex-bourbon hogsheads married into an ex-bourbon barrel. So this is technically not a single cask, but it is a delicious single malt. One that the team at Whiskey and Almond downstairs were quite fond of and uh, rated very highly. So we're just gonna have a small taste of this. Um, it's available by the Dram at Whiskey and Almond, but it's also available at, I think this one's also at Captain's Balcony in Sydney, and it's also um, available in Outturn, which launches Friday the 18th of November at midday. A-E-S-T, standard time, D-T, A-E-D-T, that's the one, I'm getting there. It's only my second dram in for the day, I'll get there eventually. It's so relaxed, It's it's got that peat uh, aroma where it doesn't slap you in the face like, you know, like a seven, eight, nine year old peated whiskey. It's not heavily peated like Isla whiskey. It's definitely got that soft, heathery, buttery sort of Orcadian peat style straight away. <sighs> like like smoky buttered croissant on the nose. Um, like blanched almonds and smoky croissant. Like an almond croissant. Ah, it's, it's a little bit sweet as well. So it could be one of those sort of almonds, almond and sugar sort of croissants. I'm gonna have a French member telling me that they don't like the way I say croissant, so that's okay. I'll, I'll, I can live with that. Very deserving of the lightly peated profile. Yeah, it's it's a lovely sweetness to it, but it's also, there's just a slight hint of that tar as well, like, um, like sort of like ship ropes and um, like salt spray. Let's have a taste. Hmm. Oh wow, that's got so much weight in the palate and yet carries its age so well. It's very clearly older spirit, um, soft and like spirit driven, but also at the same time that lovely balance of old age as well. A bit uh, heavier on the peat than some more recent, uh, we had a recent 20 year old in the, in the old and dignified profile, which was much more, um, what's the word for it? Much more sort of like less peat, but more of that sort of like old armchairs and, and, and um, soft leathers, whereas this one's a bit more uh, on the, on the, a bit richer on the mineral mineral content, if you like. Mineralic, I was gonna say. A bit mineralic. That's delightful. Delightful on the nose and palate. Mm. That's a true, um, something to put on the Christmas table and maybe keep it away from that one auntie or uncle that likes to di dip into your collection a bit, but a very um, a very tasty dram and a very special premium malt of the month. A 20 year old from Distillery 4, which is that absolute powerhouse distillery that we love in Orkney. About 20% of their malt is, uh, is, maltings are done on site. It's one of only two distilleries in Orkney. So it gives you an idea of which distillery I'm talking about. But a lot of our society members will know code number four and how amazing the spirit is from this distillery. Available in November Outturn, um, available at the Captain's Balcony and Whiskey and Almond, and available on the 18th of November in Outturn. Uh, and for members, just $3.99, of course, you have to be a member to buy it. If you're not a member of the Society, you definitely should be. Check out the links below in the description. And if you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe and bell icon so you don't miss any of our content, any of our videos, and you can learn a lot more about whiskey along the way. Sandra, catch you soon. Cheers. Bye.